What is up guys, it is Joe here from Joe Talks Wrestling, bringing you some breaking news in the pro wrestling world. Now, I didn't report on this uh, last week because I thought something like this would happen, and it has. So last week, everyone was reporting that Drew Gulak, one of the like newest up and coming wrestlers on the SmackDown roster, obviously been doing lots of stuff recently with Daniel Bryan over the last few months. Um, apparently he was released. And we figured this out because he was moved to the WWE alumni section on WWE.com, which is where they always move people that are no longer with the company. So everyone assumed Gulak was released. Then WWE never put out an official statement. It turns out Gulak's contract had actually expired and he was yet to sign a new deal. Uh, everyone thought, okay, He's not going to sign a new deal. He doesn't have a 90-day no-complete clause. He's going to show up at AEW Double or nothing. Now, a lot of you guys, um, I haven't had any questions about it. I haven't watched Double or Nothing. I've seen snippets of it. Because the WWE pay-per-views are all on the network, I can watch them, no worries. But AEW pay-per-views are more expensive. They're on Fight TV. I'm, you know, if I don't need to watch it, I'm not going to. But yeah, everyone thought Gulak was going to show up at Double or Nothing. He didn't. All of a sudden, we check WWE.com and back on their main roster section, Drew Gulak is back on there. This can only mean one thing, and that is Drew Gulak has signed a brand new deal with WWE and he is still part of the roster. So Drew Gulak is back. What do you think he's going to do? We don't know how long this new contract is, but he's back in WWE. I think he's just going to carry on like normal. Um, carry on with Daniel Bryan, do whatever. Last time we saw him, I believe, was the first round of the IC title tournament, and he lost. So let's just see what's next. I am intrigued. Drew Gulak is one of the best wrestlers on that roster, one of the best technical wrestlers the WWE has to offer entirely. Uh, him and Daniel Bryan, very similar in styles, and I absolutely love what they've been doing with him. Let's hope he can get a push sooner or later, and uh, yeah. Maybe they can win some tag belts. I don't know. The SmackDown tag division's a bit, you know, a bit all over the place at the moment with New Day and Forgotten Sons and Miz and Morrison. It's literally, it's like they're the only three teams they've got. But yeah, Drew Gulak, once again, still with the WWE. What do you guys think about this news? I think it's great. Uh, I've been Joe from Joe's Thoughts Wrestling. You guys have been awesome. Tell me what you think about it in the comment section down below. Please be sure to give this video a like, comment and subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.